Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Robert from Helton's Computer Repair. Today I'm pretty much going to be showing you how you can change your account lockout duration from the local accounts on Windows 10. This will apply for like local, but if you understand what Active Directory is for Windows in that IT field, you under know what I'm talking about. But for the rest, I'll be showing you how to do this. Pretty much what happens is, is after how many attempts you've logged in, you'll have how many minutes that you're locked out on that local account that remains locked. Um, before automatically becoming unlocked in Windows 10. This can happen also if you're in active directory, it uh, comes by how you apply that group policy on it. But same concept if you know what I'm talking about. But let's go ahead and get started. Do you want to stay in touch with the latest videos? Click that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you won't miss the next episode. Alright guys, so pretty much there's a couple ways you can do this. There's one you can do this through the local security policy. That most common people that have like Windows 10 Pro Enterprise education, they should have access for it. So I'm gonna show that one quick. And for anyone that has that doesn't have that, there's another way you can do this, but it's gonna be done through command prompt. And that'll be the one after. So let's go ahead and get started. So first one you need to do is pretty simple. Um you can go to start, you can do a search bar, you can do the win can R. Which is the one you want to come in here. I want you to do is going to type in secpool.msc. It seems it's already coming up because I've already tried this to be sure this video would work. Now, when you get to there, you'll see this big list right here. That's normal. You're going to see one that says um, account policies. You're going to select that. Then you'll see a select one that says account lockout policy. That's pretty much what we're looking into. Right now, there is no durations it's set on here. We're going to change that system to see so won't allow it to apply. So let me actually fix this real quick. Login attempts I'll put three to fix this to let it work. That's usually what they are, it's usually three attempts. And here it tells me telling me that the default is 30 minutes. So I had to enable that policy. So here's the feature where it has the account lockout durations. Um, you can change that settings by coming on here and you can set it for 15 minutes if you want to and that will apply whenever it's suggested settings and you see that apply change right here on the count durations when you reset it tells you to how you want to set it up that'll be another video you can change that settings on here too that could be set up next time do it even less like 10 minutes you know what I mean that'll get the next account lockout counter after but for the first time it's 15 minutes that I changed it and it's pretty much that simple now you would log off on the computer and this applies to all the users that are there so right now it's set right here I'm gonna go ahead and X this one out and that's pretty much how you can do that one the second option that you can do is done through um, command prompt now if I'm correct I think you could also just in PowerShell because Windows 10 and I technically you could just type in CMD and there's command prompt but if you can just right click on the start menu, I think we get into PowerShell. We're gonna choose Windows PowerShell that has the same ability on Windows on the Windows CMD file. You're gonna go ahead and select that Windows PowerShell and be sure you choose the one administrator. And yes, it will prompt you most likely. And let it come up. And here's your list right here. And there's this a little tricky how you're on there. You can type in net account. And this will apply to all the accounts that are on there, like you know, net users that are there. This will apply to all accounts. Let me actually clear this out real quick. So there's the net accounts, and it's set up right here from the lockout durations for 15 minutes because we changed that, and the lockout observation got changed to 10 because we changed that. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and change this by doing it through the command prompt. We're going to type in net account slash lockout. Duration. Am I spelling this? Ah, damn, I didn't spell it right. And then colon. I'm going to type in whatever number will be there. So I'm going to put this to 30. And it seems that this command is prompt. Now I'm going to go ahead and bring this up again. And it's set up to 30. And you see that lockout is still on 10. That's pretty much how simple it is to be done. Now we go back to the other way that we're doing from going to run. And if, I'll show it to you on there too that it's. that That will apply. And here it is set up 230. And it's pretty much that simple. Either way, thank you for watching from Helton's Computer Repair, and I'll see you on the next video.